Hey guys, Yu-Gi-Oh! God 1000 here, and today I'll be profiling the updated version of my Insector deck list for the March 2013 ban list. Let's get into the deck profile. First up, got three Insector centipedes. The uh, heart of the deck. He's your searcher, and you've got to protect him. You've got to keep him on the field, and he enables you to search out your combo pieces and adds to cons that. This makes the deck consistent. So, got to run him at three. Next, you got three Insector Ladybugs. Very uh, good for level manipulation. Uh, opens up your toolbox um, of XYZs. Um, very versatile. Can go to rank fours and rank fives. So run three. Then you got the Brothers of Destruction. You got Hornet and Dragonfly. Self-explanatory there. We all know what they do. And then last off, we've got a Gigamantis for the OTK. Only need to run one. Any more than one, and it's too inconsistent. So you got nine Insectors there. And we got Double Card Trooper to uh, help meal to my Ladybugs and Hornets. And great synergy with Cole the Haunted. Uh, two Mystic Tomato. Uh, I have these instead of Card Card Ds at the moment because Card Card D is too expensive. Hopefully it gets reprinted in the future, but at the moment I'm running two Tomatoes. If you get its effect off, it does add speed to the deck, but yeah, they're instead of Card Card D at the moment. Uh, I've got two Effect Veiler because Effect Veiler is good this format. Uh, double Tool Guide. Sangan did hurt the deck a bit, but still run two to a guide, still works well. And lastly, for the monster monsters, you got Dark Arm Dragon, self explanatory there. So, that's it for the monsters. Uh, 20 monsters, I believe. So, we've got spells, we've got Double Lance. Pretty much like an MST, gets around bottomless trap hole, saves your centipede, uh, gets over fiendish chain, breakthrough skill, stuff like that, gets your plays off there. Uh, two insector swords, the OTK, don't need any more than two. Uh, two durality to add to consistency. Uh, only two MST this time, because I re um, realised that this format doesn't rely on, on back row as much as the past format, such as Dino Rabbits and stuff like that. Macro Rabbit, um, E Dragons, Prophecies, Evil Swans, the Meta doesn't really have that much back row, so I just thought I'd drop it down to two. Although I can run, I could go back up, up to three, considering that MST helps Insectors offensively and defensively. Uh, then onto the staples, got Foolish, Heavy, Reborn, and Dark Hole. For the spells, it's 11 spells there. Sorry, 10 spells. Sorry, I'm not sure. Um, so, under the traps, it's Solemn Duo, self explanatory, triple threatening roar, MVP of the deck, uh, saves your weak monsters so you get their combos off, and punishes your opponent for overextending. Three Coal the Haunted, really good synergy with Card Trooper, and really really good for Coal the Haunting back your Dragonflies and Insect or other Insect or cards when you detach them as from XYZs. And lastly, just two Compulse because it's really versatile. You can bounce back your own monsters and others, uh, Synchro monsters and XYZ, your opponents. So that's it for the main deck there, 40 cards. So onto the extra deck now. Uh, for the rank twos, I just got a Gachi, just to fill space really, and in case I have two ladybugs on the field, but that basically never happens. Now onto the main toolbox of the deck, the rank threes. We've got a Levier to get back your banished cards, and if Centipede gets banished, combos well with our Dark Arm Dragon as well. Got a Zen Mains, Tem Tempo. Leviathan, Acid Golem, and Giga Brilliant. Brilliant. Sit for the rank threes. Onto the rank fours. 
pretty staple really. You've got a Steel Swarm Roach, Maestro, Utopia. And onto the rank fives. Got Tyrus, Insector, Exostag, which I really like. Uh, Tyrus. And I'm waiting on a Volcasaurus at the moment, and it should be here soon, but that's a really good card. So that's my last rank five there, Volcasaurus. And Volcasaurus works really well with this next card, Guy Dragon. Get out of the Volcasaurus, pop one of their face-up monsters, they take damage, then you overlay for a Guy Dragon, and you swing for a direct attack. So... That's it for the extra deck. Only 14 at the moment because I'm waiting on that, uh, waiting on that Volcasaurus. So that's it for the deck today, guys. Uh, comment below on what you think of the updated build and whether you have any suggestions for the deck. Uh, thanks for watching. And just remember to uh, like the video, thumbs up, and subscribe. Thank you.